What's up everybody? Welcome to the life of a board gamer. My name is Daniel and today we are going to talk about the game Dr. Red. It's a new game from Blue Orange Games and in <laughs> I, I don't know what's with me but recently I really like more and more team games where team is the Reds for some strange reason, not sure why, but in this one you are as you can see Dr. Red. So this is a game where you play once against few and uh, basically it's a cooperative game. Uh, you as a Dr. Rat need to tell each of the rats you need to keep them healthy for eight turns or eight meals if you want to say so. And uh, while they eat, they have some specific diets, some food that they don't like or some food that they really prefer. And you need to like explain them what they need to do with this food and all that. So yeah, uh, let's open the box. Let me show you what you get inside. And while we do that, I'm going to tell you why I like this the game. Now, first thing first, what I like about it is that the box itself is actually used as a gameplay device, so to say. It's a screen uh, uh, where behind it you will keep all your, uh, if you are playing as a Dr. Rat, you will keep all your uh, components and all that. So, uh, as you can see, uh, two rule books with, I think, three or four languages in each of them. So that's the blue orange stuff thing where they give you like, they have to translate game in each of the languages. So you have a trash can. This is where your rats will go to eat if they think they are uh, not allowed to eat any of the food of the table from the table if they figure out. This one is used to track your meals and on certain, uh, on certain spaces you will get some extra cards or you will get no cards at all. Uh, for your uh, to choose meals for your opponents. You get a cute nice little rat to track those meals and uh, basically this is what is held in front of you as a red doctor red and you will just put the screen like this and you will have this over here and now what you are going to have behind your screen is a bunch of cards and some tokens so these tokens are uh, they are used to like uh, tell rats different things so you will tell them like you will use this one to take some new cards because the cards you have are really not helpful to anyone actually and you need some new cards with the new food and all that so these tokens are used for that and once they are flipped you can also use them uh, one more time to tell some rats to don't eat certain food now this is uh, the food that the rats will eat so there's like a carrots and cheese or tomatoes there's some soda or blue cheese and as you can see, they are color coded, but they also have some uh, icons uh, that are over here and numbers. Now, all of these may come in a matter of what rat can or can't eat. And uh, yeah, basically they are trying to figure out what they uh, what are they allowed to eat and what they are not allowed to eat. Now, for, uh, on the st from the start of the game, uh, each of the rats will have their own card with a starting food and a starting color and starting number because those could matter and uh, you will choose randomly some of these cards uh, for each of the rats uh, or group of rats and you will choose some of these cards and it will tell you what type of food they want to eat like certain colors or certain numbers of food or if they have to like uh, eat every time a different card, different type of food, different type number of food, stuff like that. So there's really a lot of possi different possibilities. There's also these advanced diseases that you can uh, mix in if you want some more challenging game, uh, which we didn't find that funny. We actually like it as it is. So yeah, basically uh, it's super simple game. It's um, as I said, uh, you are playing for eight turns, but the thing is that you as a doctorate and all the subjects of this game, uh, you all need to win together. And you do that by surviving eight rounds and everybody has to survive the eight rounds. So if at any point one of you is dead, one of the rats is dead because they ate too much wrong food, you automatically lose the game. So it's not like they don't play anymore and then you continue playing. So the game stops for everybody. And uh, basically the main thing is to drag your rats to the last meal, to the eighth meal. And uh, in, in that last meal they need to eat, I want to say last supper so much. And on that last meal they need to all eat their correct food, otherwise you lose. And uh, yeah, as I said, sometimes the numbers will matter, like you want to eat a different number each time. It's really up to them to figure out, uh, when, because when they eat the good food they will put it like on this... Uh, 
uh, side up will be where this is like a green check mark and if they eat the wrong food next turn you will put it like this and if at any point the rats has three X's it automatically dies of course you have some pills so you can cover two of those X's and heal them before they die which is uh, really handy when you need it and uh, yeah that's Dr. Rat uh, now do I like it? yeah I really do otherwise I would not film a video about it and uh, why I like it is because it kind of feels like those dungeon crawlers one against all but you are actually playing cooperatively together with the dungeon master so to say and uh, when you put the food out and when you see people start to talk and uh, figure out which food is for which player why was that food wrong for them or why was that food right for them there's really no alpha player in this game everybody converses between them everybody is, is, is like Figuring, trying to figure out things like, yeah, but then this happens and there is, you know, there, there can't be one player and he says like, oh, I know everything, you eat this, you eat this. No, people really talk with each other and that's what I really liked about it. So Dr. Red is a, and it's super easy game. Uh, the rulebook is not the best. I'll be honest, I disliked reading the rulebook. There's lots of informations in it. Uh, I mean, it's a valuable information, but sometimes it just feels like it bores me with unnecessary details. Just get to the point, tell me what the rules are about and I don't know, just power through the rule book. I promise you behind it, it's a fun, fun game of, of uh, I would want to say cat and mouse, of mouse and mouse, of uh, rats eating uh, all kinds of junk food and trying to survive for eight rounds. Really fun game, I absolutely love it, so definitely check it out, Dr. Rat. So yeah, that's all I have to say about it. It's a really cool game. I really, really liked it. And uh, yeah, see you next time. Pozdrav.